for one county has been ahead of the game for several weeks now getting the COVID-19 vaccine out. Shelby County Health Department officials say around 22% of the county's almost 6,000 residents have gotten their first dose. WGEM's Frank Healy spoke with those working at the clinic in Shelbina who were giving people their second doses. Today he tells us how they made it all happen. Well, this is my second shot. Uh, today's process was pretty painless and, and short. Chris Coe, one of hundreds today getting the second dose of the Moderna vaccine in Shelbina, Missouri at St. Mary Catholic Church's Father Buman Center. His job as a park ranger is the reason he felt it's important to get the vaccine. To try to be safe uh, with my job as well there at Mark Twain Lake. Um, we try to uh, still provide services to the public. Shelby County Health Department Administrator Audrey Goff says getting people like Co vaccinated takes a community effort. She says they got to the nearly 22% with help from the vaccination efforts of the community, local nursing homes, and Hannibal Regional. The three combinations has made it so that we have a high number of our population already getting their first dose of vaccine. Gove says moving forward, she hopes more and more people know someone who has gotten the vaccine, so more and more people become less apprehensive. I'm too scared of it. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. Well, the response has been wonderful. We've been really appreciative of people listening to the science, listening to the medical people and understanding what this means for the future. And Goff says another important aspect of that success is the facility itself here. And she says it's thanks to Father Benjamin Nwosu, pastor at St. Mary's, who got the second dose today for letting them use the facilities. It went very well. I, I, I didn't feel any you know, any pain on my arms, you know. He says he hopes community efforts like these help keep people safe. And, uh, and hopefully, you know, this virus will be over. Frank Healy, WGEM News, Shelbina, Missouri.